And boys, welcome and today we are back with another video for you boys with top 5 songs of the week. So as you can see we're on a bit of a different backdrop, that is because I'm up north with my family, up in Yorkshire seeing my family and we do have a little bit of a different setup today so it should get quite interesting this one, but you never know. Anyway, top 5 songs of the week, nonetheless, let's just jump this hop on. Okay, I apologise as well quickly for my mic quality because I haven't got my, my primary microphone, obviously I've got this one which I used to use and I can tell the background noise is obviously a little bit worse but hopefully it's not too bad for you. Boys. Anyway, rolling in at number five. Rolling in at number five is Coldplay with the new album. I don't know what it's called, but yeah, is and, and you're gonna say, oh, gay Coldplay. Yeah, I don't care. I literally, just, I don't care. Shut up. Um, so rolling in at number five, we have Coldplay with Adventure of a Lifetime. I don't even care what he says. It's just that little, it's that little. That bit is sick. It's actually quality. I don't even care if you don't like Coldplay. It's a sick tune. And rolling at number four, we have a bit of a bass line as well. This is back to the like the hardcore bass line music, and we have got "Feed 'Em to the Lions" by Twenty. Well, if a solo forty-five. This is just a. If you want to get pumped, get your headphones ready. No one can save you from me. You told that little shit. Look, there's no running from me. Fucking diving from me. No one can save you from me. Fuck it, I'm straight. Be a better liar. Be a better liar. one of the most hardcore tracks I've ever heard in my life it's actually mad I can't believe I didn't I think I've heard it before but I never come across it like and actually properly listen to it but what the what the bloody hell was this but it's decent it's actually really good and yeah I like it in a way yeah it's just it gets me pumped you know what I'm saying if I feel I feel like I'm actually eat a lion which is why it's called I don't even know Coming in at number three is Kendrick Lamar's new track with J. Cole. Now this is actually quite a good song. It's called Black Friday. I do like it. It's not really one of the like the bass drop kind of music or anything like that. It's a bit more of like a chill rap, bit relaxed, but then it's kind of I like the fact that this one's got a simple bass like bass backing track. So this is number three, J. Cole and Kendrick Lamar with Black Friday. The whole industry been in shambles. Everybody from Gazy Young just changing the channel. Kendrick Lamar, the people's champion, a man of for analysts. Career damaging verses, meditating when candles lit. I like my raps extra prolific. Some freestyle and no lunch tables and park benches. And I won't mention my 10,000 hours in training. More of a relaxed song, but it's actually good. Got a good bass track behind it, and it's a bit simple, but I like the fact that it's got like the sirens in it and all that kind of good stuff. But, you know, I like it. I like it. It's a good tune. And I hope you boys like the lighting as well. I'm using my cousin's light. It's like blinding me sat here, but hopefully you boys can actually see my face well. Number two is a song that's based around Rebound, X, Rhythm and Gash. If you guys haven't heard that, I'll leave a link down to that in the description. Or you can click on screen here now to hear it. Basically what it is, it's a remix based around that. Well, I, f I actually think this song came out before it and then they made that remix from it. But this is this has got actually, this has got rapping is by Skepta. So I know you're watching. And Take It Away, Skepta featuring Jammer with I Spy. The four best crews in the game, I'm in them. If you don't like me, do something then. Ten minutes screw faces, I ain't in them. I want paper, dibby dibby wages, I ain't in them. Good song, it's quite I like the lyrics as well, it does make me laugh. Some of the lyrics it's skeptic. You know he's a good you know he's just good, he's had a massive year him and along with other likes of like what's his name? I don't even know. Stormzy, that's it, and all them like you know, they've had a sick year, Jeremy and all that lot. Making our top spot this week goes to Ongoing thing 20 SYL Odyssey. I think I've said that right, I apologise if I've murdered that name. But it, this is a good song, it really is. Again, it's another one that I found in the last few days or so. But I actually, re funny enough, it's weird, but I really, I really like it. So here you go, ongoing thing. At the start, I love it. It's sick. It sounds like a blooming bird that's getting absolutely rammed in the arse crack. I don't even know why, but it actually sounds sick. I love it. It's a good tune. It's a nice, relaxed one, but also it gets me kind of like the do 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 do. Do you know what I mean? It's quite a catchy tune. So, I hope you boys have enjoyed that one, and that comes in at number one ongoing thing. It's a nice one, actually. It's a really nice tune. Just have enjoyed this episode of Top Five Songs of the Week. We are obviously almost, this is like almost on tour, isn't it? You know, let me know if you want me to come to your local place. 
Now, I'm guessing that's not actually going to happen, but hope you boys enjoy it. Smash that button if you haven't joined luck again. I'll leave all the links down below to the song so you can click on screen as per usual. But I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Don't forget to smash that button if you have enjoyed. We are away. I will be back soon. Regular videos. I've got a pack of which came out yesterday because you're seeing this on Monday. And yeah, smash that button if you enjoyed, and I'll see you guys soon. Peace. Right, next pack, we're going to go for the toe pack. You know what we're all about. Toe pack. Bang. There we go. Toe pack a Rooney. Can they give us something? Could it be Rooney? Could it be? Is it Rooney? Oh, Daniel Sturridge. There you go. English.